Amid the pandemic, online shopping became the only way for us to have our fill of retail therapy. However, feeling the strain more than ever before are our high street stores, with high streets becoming more and more barren. In a bid to save local high streets, 69 towns in England have secured funding from the historic England High Streets Heritage Scheme. The four-year development will bring vacant shops back into use and it will also set up office spaces and creative spaces. This will create more jobs for the ever-increasing number of unemployment at the moment due to the coronavirus pandemic. Andrew Sugden, the director, has spoken to me about his plans with one of the high streets, Gosport High Street, that has received £1.78 million of government funding. As part of my wider responsibilities, I am project directing the Gosport High Street Heritage Action Zone. This location has secured £1.78 million of government funding as part of a wider £3.2 million regeneration programme designed to revitalise and animate the twin conservation areas of Gosport High Street. I have spoken to some Gosport locals about their thoughts and feelings on the regeneration of Gosport High Street and what they feel this money will bring to the town. It's changed and it's changed for the worst. We used to have a thriving market every Saturday Every Tuesday, the high street was full of people. The high street was full of market traders. Um, so it's not changed for the better. We've uh, we spent hundreds of thousands of pounds on discussions and um, fees. Rise of the internet. Um, that that didn't help. We've got um, a fantastic history alongside Portsmouth harbour there um, between the submarine museum and the explosion museum um, could be completely renovated uh, with uh, Endeavour Quay being set up on the old campus site um, old pubs um, and various businesses right along the um, harbour side to redevelop that whole area would be playing to Gosport strengths along the waterfront as well as um, generating incredible revenue for bars and restaurants all along that waterfront. With the funding soon to be secured and plans in place, the future is looking bright for our high streets. Alice Howell, Winall News.